the rapid evolution of the automotive landscape has led to a paradigm shift in the way we perceive and experience mobility. ADAS technologies have emerged as the cornerstone of this transformation. And ADAS now, it is at a critical intersection of automotive engineering cutting edge technology. ADAS show 2023 will be held on 7th December this year at ICAT which is the international uh, center of uh, testing which is uh, which functions under the ministry of heavy industries it will have vehicle manufacturers it will have the companies who manufacture ADAS components it will have ADAS testing equipment providers and all connected stakeholders who are there will be present in this show from the government perspective ADAS holds immense promising in addressing several key challenges which we are facing in the automobile industry today. One of them is enhanced road safety. A large number of people unfortunately die in accidents today in the country. ADAS has several features such as automatic braking, adaptive cruise control and it can prevent human errors. Human errors have been known to be an important cause for uh, accidents leading to fatalities and serious injuries. Also traffic management and congestion management. We know our cities are uh, riddled with congestion and ADS technologies have a, a way to ease congestion and they can enable communication with each other of the vehicles by way of what we call connected technology. So connected vehicles is also an important part uh, of the system. Then there is an advantage of environmental sustainability. The integration of ADAS into vehicles it supports the broader goal of reducing the carbon footprint which our Honorable Prime Minister has given a target of net zero by 2070 and you know in COP26 the five aims of Panchamrit were very lucidly uh, set forth as the nationally determined contributions what we must do to reduce carbon. Through optimized driving behaviors and energy consumption, ADAS can contribute to a greener future, thereby contributing to the uh, mission of net zero by 2070. Also economic growth and innovation. As the automotive industry embraces ADAS technologies, it will foster innovation, it will lead to job creation and economic growth. So this show which you can see here, ADAS show, this will be a unique platform where government officials, where OEMs, manufacturers, users, all of them can interact with each other and learn from each other. The Indian automobile industry last year clocked a global size of $151 billion. We are the third largest automobile market in the world and our exports of automobile and auto components are rising. In auto components alone, we did a, about $20 billion worth of export in last financial year 22-23. And as we move towards a larger and a better automobile system, people want better technologies. People want advanced automotive technologies. And ADAS is an important part of the advanced automotive technologies. And as you can see that more and more OEMs are now adopting one or the other form of ADAS. ADAS is in five steps. So somebody is at step one, somebody is at step two. But we can be sure that in the future, more and more of automobiles, whether two-wheelers, three-wheelers, four-wheelers, buses, commercial vehicles or passenger vehicles, they will be using some form or the other of the, of the ADAS systems. The Ministry of Heavy Industries is, uh, welcomes everybody to participate in this show and we look forward to have engaging dialogues with thought leaders and with international presence, industry experts and other academicians and the general public who would come here and be a part of this fantastic show. Thank you.